house house Excited? I'm excited. I'm no, excited. right now. It's okay. in there. Oh shit. <laughs> she said to make a U-turn. No, don't listen to that bitch. I could key that sky, it's so blue. What do you mean by key it? I could like get rid of it. <laughs> Are you spooked yet? Whoa. Spooky, right? <laughs> Spooky. Outside of the Winchester house, we're gonna have to go dark for this one. Stay tuned. Hey, do you know which way to the red red <laughs> do you know which way to the do you know which way to the Redwood Grove Trail? This way, to the Redwood Grove Trail. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Come on. There you go, this is what you came for. Take a moment to breathe in the forest air. Feeling the temperature difference between the parking lot where y'all stand. Look up. You have entered a special type of temperate rainforest, an old growth coastal redwood forest. These trees grow beyond 300 feet tall and live to the ma mature age of over 2,000 years. Rainy and foggy coastal conditions ensure that there's enough moisture for their survival. What else? Only leaves. There's these little guys too. wise creatures that have just been quietly living here. You know? Like, don't they look like they know things? When you stay on the trail and don't climb in the trees, you are doing your part to ensure that these beautiful redwoods are preserved for future generations. Hundreds of thousands of people use this path each year. Each of us has the responsibility to treat these incomparable trees with reverence and respect. Please stay on the trail and do not climb on the trees. Thank you. If you fall. If I fall. <laughs> <laughs> no, we have to laugh. <laughs> The giant. Aptly named, this tree called the giant grows 270 feet tall and over 17 feet wide, almost as high as a 25-story building. Imagine a tree this large grows from a seed the size of an oatmeal flake. Redwood seeds come from olive-sized cones containing an average of 60 to 120 seeds. The redwood forest floor is thickly covered with leaves, so seeds rarely find their way to the soil except after a fire or flood. It is amazing to think that a tree the size of a giant can germinate from something so small. Oh, hello. Come closer. Let me tell you the real story of the Redwood Forest without all the PG stuff.
thousand years ago, people started bringing their dead here. And none of these redwoods were this big at the time. They're, they're moderately sized trees. Um, when they started bringing their dead here, the trees started getting much larger. And they figured the souls of the dead were energizing these trees. And so now it is believed by Native American Indians of the West Coast, because those motherfuckers believe a lot of weird shit. It's believed that the reason why the, the redwoods are so large is because when you die, your soul goes into these trees. And if you're a nature lover, it's an eternity of bliss. But if you hate nature, you'll forever be a tree and you'll be screaming for help. And if you listen close at night, you can hear the screams of the damned as they are trying to break free from the bark of the redwood tree. <laughs>